the third pillar covers vessel traffic monitoring, which is an area where the agency's responsibilities are developing rapidly. Here, the ultimate goal is to enable EU member states to identify all commercial ships in and around their waters, and to know their position, heading, destination and cargo, particularly when the cargo could be potentially dangerous. The system is based on shore-based stations receiving signals from ships heading towards or leaving EU ports. This information will contribute to improving safety in general, prevention and detection of pollution by ships, and the response of authorities to emergencies. The system being developed builds on the Safe CNET concept, and it will eventually receive AIS Automatic Identification System and LRIT Long Range Identification and Tracking data from all ships of interest to EU member states. A significant development underway is the setup of the EU LRIT data center, which will receive data from EU flagged ships and which will also exchange data with other LRIT data centers around the world. This is perhaps the most challenging task, but also the one where EMSA's added value can most clearly be demonstrated. The Clean CNET system has been set up so that EMSA can supply member states with a satellite monitoring capability that can spot oil slicks in and around EU waters and monitor their position and size. Clean CNET obtains pollution data from Envisat and Radarsat satellites and relays it to member state operators. This gives them the information necessary to confirm the pollution using surface vessels or surveillance aircraft and to identify culprits. The system has the potential to be a major deterrent to deliberate pollution by ships in and around EU waters, particularly once the safe CNET and clean CNET systems are properly integrated.